Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to enable double tap to wake on the Motorola Moto G. Uh, let me show you first, like this. So you could see it works, and it works pretty fine. Now, how you should do that is you should install a kernel, which is Fox kernel. I'll leave the link in description. Just download it. Uh, and you should have a rooted phone with CWM installed. So uh, I leave the link in description to my video that how to root and install CWM on the Motorola Moto G. So uh, a double tap to wake. I have seen many videos regarding it, but uh, actually none of them work. Some of them work, but uh, uh, some of them don't work. So now let's start. Let me show you the downloaded file. Which looks like this Falcon UMTS Fox KK 443 4.4.3. Yeah, 4.4.3 and 4.4.4 is almost the same. So let's just go to recovery. Now we are in the recovery now. I advise you to take the backup before proceeding anything else by going to the backup and restore. Now after you have taken a backup, uh, wipe Dalvik cache and wipe cache. You could see why uh, it is the fourth option from the first line. Just wipe them. I am not going to be wiping it because I have already done it. Now let's install the zip which is Falcon UMTS Fox 123 again just do it and it will work so I'll see you in the boot up screen So it has almost booted up now. So, uh, and uh, if you want to enable the double tap to wake, uh, so you should first download uh, uh, an expose module called Moto Guide from Expose Installer. I'll show you one more way if you don't uh, like or have Expose Installer. So first check this way out. Pretty easy. Just go to download and type in Moto Guide. I have already installed it, you could see. Which has a G logo. Just go in there and enable double tap to wake, which is the last option. And just apply changes. And it will work. So let's try it. You could see it works. Now let me show you with the one more way, which is Trickster mod. I've installed it, but now it says to install BusyBox. I'll install it. I'll install it. Now Trickster mod is basically a kernel tweaker. It works with almost every kernel, I think. So let's just install it. So I have configured the settings and now we are in the trickster mode. So there's a trick to do that. Just go on the left side and three lines and go to specific and uh, go down and go to screen wake control and just uh, time and double tap to wake one time. You can type in 2, 3 or 1, it will just uh, work with 1, means 2 taps. So you can see it works. 
and it works pretty fine now sweep to wake uh, let's try sweep to wake 2 afterwards it just works with 2 you can see let's try with 4 now Yeah, it again works with two taps. It is automatically configured to one, I think. Yeah. So it doesn't work, actually. This. So you could see it comes back to one. Now let's just sweep to wake. It basically means you are just swiping the screen when the screen is off or on. So let's swipe. So it basically doesn't work, I think. Yeah, it doesn't. So you could say it doesn't work. This uh, double tap to wake works pretty fine. So this was a video, guys. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe for more video videos.